our forgiveness towards others should stem from a realization of God's love that is continuous for us. In Proverbs 19, verse 11, the Bible states this, Sensible people control their temper. They earn respect by overlooking wrongs. Some people can be discourteous. They can even be cruel. And they can be unfair, unkind, and unappreciative. And sometimes they get angry and they get frustrated. So what is a person to do when others behave in such ways, right in front of you, right in your face? God's answer is straightforward, forgive. But often, this loses everything in modern translation. Forgive, in first century Christianity, meant self-release. If someone is dispensing poison, you don't have to drink it. And if you do drink it, you don't have to hold on to it tightly, especially for the rest of your life. It is to be released as quickly as you can, as quick as possible. In Luke 6, 37, Jesus instructs, Do not judge and you will not be judged. Do not condemn, and you will not be condemned. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. Today and every day, determine to be quick, quick to forgive others for their shortcomings. When you are able to spiritually do so, you won't take on the shadow, the darkness that, that they will <laughs> cast on you. No, you'll, you'll repel it like water off of a duck's back. And when the people around you misbehave, and they will from time to time, remember that we all, yourself included, have moments when we are not at our best. Just forgive the offender as quickly as you can, and try to move on as quickly as you can.